Fuck this, I'm going pyro. Hello, thousand pound pig here. I'm here playing Team Fortress 2, and this is the second episode of the How Do You TF2? Because this is a question I think is pretty important. Uh, I'm pyro now, because as you saw before, I got frustrated, and this is what I usually do. When I get frustrated, I change. I go to pyro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get off the map! Love it. That's also why I like- Oi! You're gonna get off the map too! Oi! No! No! Get off me! Damn! Oh well. That's where you piss at me. Um, yeah, I like going as Pyro when I, whenever I'm frustrated or something. It just- It's- I would say it's the easiest class to play. But there's also a lot of depth with it. It's just like any class for Team Fortress. Where are they? Uh, don't know. Uh, but I, I also like being kind of strategical as a power because... Look at this guy. See ya! <laughs> That's why I love the pyro. That's the um, the compression blast which the pyro has. No other class can do that. Uh, a soldier can kind of do it. But, you know, it's an explosion. And, whoa! And, um... I believe the pyro can as well. Oh, what's going on there? What, what sentry is that? Ah. Alright. Yeah, I like this map. This map is called Hightower, by the way. And if you don't know about Hightower, then I'll describe it a little bit. This is Hightower. This is what it's named after. This big tower in the middle with three different levels. There's health in, in the bottom floor and the health up to the top floor, right there usually. But this map is known for soldiers, because it's great for soldier jumping. You can see two of them right there. See that? They use their rocket launcher and they just bounce all over the place. It's insane. Whoa. Uh, but Hightower's good because it also has a lot of hiding spots. As you can see, like there's in this little room there, health also spawns there. I, it's not spawning for some reason. People are just picking it up. Uh, some in there. It's just all over the place. There's a lot of nice ambush spots. There is a lot of cover, but snipers are usually on the here and there as well. Uh, a spawn is right there and right there. But this is a payload race map, which means this bomb needs to go right here. This capture zone. This is the red bomb. I will show you the tracks. Here we go. And it crosses over here with some blue tracks. And this is their track. So they are trying to do the exact same thing on the other side of the map because it's a mirrored it's a mirrored version. They have to capture it there, and red team have to capture it here. So that's basically payload, uh, uh, payload race high tower. But this is where I like hanging out. I like this little building here. Ah, oh, there's some health there. Because of this, this huge cliff. If people get thrown off there, they die. Okay, they can't. There's no way they can come back unless they're up here, like where my camera is, and they have a parachute or they have some clever way to get back. But usually if you're a pyro, you hang around here, around these sides, I would push that heavy off with the compression blast. And same thing over here because it's a merit version. Look! Ah, oh, see that scout had a double jump. Ah, oh, come on pyro! Ah, oh, bad luck. So I usually just hang around here, especially when the cart is around there. So I usually do that around here, but there's this dirty camping demo man doing that right now. See, I usually wait right here. Also, just a tip, if you are a pyro and you're hiding around a corner, whoop, 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 they can they can see you like this, okay? So, just switch to a secondary weapon, especially the home wrecker or, well, any weapon. Whoops. Oh, you're a spy. You're a spy. Get out of here. Oh, shoot. I just got to keep an eye on that cart. When they push that a little bit, oh, there, there. Watch this. No! Crap! Get up! Don't look down! Don't look down! Damn, I really wanted, him, wanted to throw him off. Oh well. Boo! No, I thought he would think I was a spy. <laughs> I also like this. This is the scorch shot. I will just grow up. What are you doing, spy? I mean, the sniper. You're dead. What's over there? Ah, uh, yes, this scorch shot. It's like, it knocks everyone back. What are you doing? 
Yeah, it knocks everyone back once it hits them, and it also sets them on, on fire. Oh, Sniper, what are you doing, buddy? I think I hear the Sniper. Basically, as soon as I turn the corner, I'm going to push him. Uh, the worst thing... <laughs> Get! Where, where is he? Oh, what? Ah, oh, I missed. Got him again. <laughs> oh, rip. Look how close he got. Uh, okay, where are they? Oh, oh, please, I need health. No, the engine needs it, obviously. Come on, health. Spawn. Oh, really, dude? Get off the health point. Ah. Oh. I would help him if I can. No. You go get him, Angie. I need health. Oh, I must have picked it up. <laughs> Not much. What? Ah, oh, sniper. So I think Pyro is a pretty deep class, just like any class in TF2. It's you know they they are all deceptively deep. Okay, like you you wouldn't expect stuff to be pretty. Get off! Yeah. Ah. Oh. Yeah, Pyro does have this this uh, ability. The flamethrower is a, is a primary fire, but the secondary fire is that. I'll show you that again. It's just a, a compression blast. It blows back a bunch of air. So if a rocket fire gets fired at you, or a, a bow, or any kind of projectile, look at this guy. What are you doing, man? Uh, what are you doing? I'm gonna... Throw him out to sea. <laughs> no, leave me alone, sniper. <laughs> Worth it. <laughs> All right, I just saw an NG. What's he doing? No, get out of here. No. 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 Nope, yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I like that one. Oh! Bouncing him off the wall. Oh wow, there's so many snipers! This is a dream if I can get there. Alright, go up these steps and snipers galore up there. Three of them! For me? <laughs> Alright, where are they? There's there. I want to throw him off. Ah! I don't care if you were in stealth. You should be out there. Yep. Uh oh. Did I hit? Oh, I hit him. <laughs> okay, now I am on a different server. This time I'm on the red team, and I have a bit of a different loadout. This time I have a shotgun. Same flamethrower, I think. Now the shotgun is mainly so I can just be more useful at long range because, as you saw in the last few rounds, the scorch shot was good, but I wouldn't really say that it it, fi it doesn't fire fast. You know, if you see it, if you see someone shoot it, you can usually dodge it. Ah, uh, what did I see there? All right, bring it on. Get off. <laughs> My tower. No! Gotta save the engineer! Okay. Alright. I had to jump off the tower because I wanted to save an engineer. He was He's trying to set up a sentry. And I've been team swapped. Of course. This is why I basically stopped playing Team Fortress because when you're with a friend, you can barely play with them even if they're on your friends list because it just automatically switches you so much. 
and that's really really frustrating. But also, you get team swapped a lot. Whoop! The whoa! What the hell happened there? You see what I just did there? I, re I reflected one of the rockets. Come on, where are you? You're a spy! This is my tower, get off! Ah, oh, I didn't time it right there. It's mostly predicting when, they, when they're when they that close, you have to predict it. Like, you have to trust that they will shoot you with a rocket and you have to try hit them. You have to try and reflect it. Good, get off. Get off. Oh, I tried to push him back in time. I was just a bit too slow. Look at that smile. What an asshole. Yes, finally got it. Now I gotta hold it. Get off! What did I just press? Okay. I'm holding it. I'm holding it! What are they gonna do about it? What's he doing? <laughs> okay, I think he knows what's up now. Oh, look at this. Get off! My tower! No, I'll run out of ammo! <laughs> yeah, that's the problem with this pressure blast. It takes a lot of ammo. You can just use your flamethrower and you don't use as much. Oh, you again! This damn pyro! Oh. No, 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 no. What? What's he doing? <laughs> he has like the same loadout as me. He has a shotgun and the degreaser, and he's just pushing people off. <laughs> what? What is he doing? <laughs> High five! Oops, this is awkward. Wait, get off my head! No! No! <laughs> I think he wants a tower for himself. <laughs> yeah, no scouts allowed. Oh, pirates. Love them. Oh, get him, bro. Ah. Oh. I don't know what. This is. Alright. We'll just wait here, I guess. Just me and. I don't even know his name. We'll just chill out together. <laughs> Oh no! Get off! Get off! No, you too. No reds allowed. Get off! Alright, Heavy, you grab the health. Heavy! Okay, you eat a sandwich then, whatever. I'm not one to judge. Get off! Get off! Get off! I didn't burn you, sorry, I miss you. Where'd you go? Uh oh. Get off! 
They really want this tower all of a sudden. Uh oh, watch the snipers. So you see this is kind of a, a build for the power which is like um... What's that guy's name in 300? Leonidas or something? Where he just kicks the guy down the pit? It's basically like that. But you kick people off the tower. But this is Pyro! It's protecting my turf. It's my home, okay? I live on this tower. It's high tower. It's my tower. Get off! Get off! Bye bye! No! No, you're going too! You're going too! See ya! <laughs> okay, well, I think I'll just leave you there. <laughs> that is how I play TF2. That's how I have fun as the Pyro. I like to. Well, I choose it when I get frustrated. Kind of like a serious try hard mode, but then eventually I go into like push people off of things. You know, like I hold the tower on high tower or I push people off the cliff. What do you do? How do you play Team Fortress when you choose a Pyro? Do you choose a Pyro at all? And, if, you know, do you like him? And let's just. Post it in the comment and let me know and we can just and we can just talk. But be sure to vote in this screen and I'll see you at the next one.